2022 question based on statements consider the question and two statements given below question what is the age of manisha statement one manisha is 24 years younger than her mother say this is manisha okay manisha's mother manisha's age is y mother's age is x manisha is 24 years younger than her mother manisha is manisha's age is x minus 24 her mother age is x 24 years younger than her mother that means x minus 24 so from this we can say x minus y minus 24 is equal to 0 equation 1 this gives nothing this tells nothing about manisha's age my friend so statement 1 alone is not sufficient to answer the question now 5 years later manisha's age would be y plus 5 her mother's age would be x plus 5 okay so these are in the ratio the ages of manisha and her mother will be in the ratio manisha and her mother okay this is 3 by 5 now from this you can get an equation 5y plus 25 5 into this okay 3 into that is equal 3x plus 15 3x minus 5y 15 minus 25 that is equal to minus 10 this is 0 equation number 2 this equation alone doesn't give anything about manisha's age so this also not sufficient now let's combine these two equation see uh, the ratios of the coefficients of x and y 1 by 3 okay minus 1 by minus 5 that is a 1 by 5 okay minus minus gets cancelled so 1 by 3 is not equal to 1 by 5 that means these two equations have a solution this is what we learnt in algebra just because we are getting two equation doesn't mean they have solution if the coefficients are same okay that means these two lines are parallel they never meet they will not have intersection point there is no solution in that case answer would be d but the ratio of the coefficients of x and y is not equal that means they are intersecting these are non-parallel lines they have a solution so both statement 1 and 2 are sufficient to answer the question we need not find the answer all we are looking here is can we answer this question using these equations yes we can answer so answer is c